Spring is here and we've got new growth and this is the perfect time to fertilize our plants. When we see new growth on our shrubs and trees, new leaves leafing out, new leaf buds, new flower buds, that signifies spring is here and it's a good time to fertilize. Now let's talk about what types of fertilizers we wanna use. And we should start with our macronutrients. Now you've purchased fertilizers in the past and you might be wondering what are those numbers on the front of the fertilizer bag and what do they mean? Well, we have three macronutrients that are important to plants. First, we have nitrogen that is very important for vegetative growth, so our our leaves and it's uh, responsible for the green color in our plants or partially responsible. Um, that is the first number on the label. So you'll see here, this is our nitrogen. Then we have our phosphorus number and that one's important for root formation, for fruits, for flowers and um, for overall health of our plants. It helps them fight disease. And then lastly, we have potassium that is excellent for making strong stems and for flowering of the plants. So when we're talking about things like shrubs and trees that we wanna fertilize or our lawn, those require things that have higher nitrogen levels. So you can see right here, this tree and shrub, it'll have the higher nitrogen number. As we talk about tomatoes and vegetables or let's say vegetables and flowering plants, those last two numbers are a little bit more important and so we'll see higher numbers there. But you can go with a complete fertilizer like you see here, 12, 12, 12, even numbers. You can also utilize things like liquid fertilizers and don't forget about your organic fertilizer. But spring is here and it's time to fertilize those plants. Forget it growing, I'm Heather Kirk Ballard with the LSU Ag Center.